Hi Ennis, it's Claire from the future. Before we get into the unboxing, I forgot to mention that this diamond painting was squares and I am an affiliate with Pretty Neat Creative. So if you use a link in my description below, you will get a percentage off. I think it's 15, I'm not sure. But I will also make a little, little bit of commission. So again, it's in the description below. And let's get on to the video. Bye. Hi honeys. So today's video we have got Happy Mail. And I'm really excited about this. So we've got two boxes. And I'm going to save this one to last. Just because I can. And this one is a competition I won from... Pretty neat creative. Now they were doing a competition on Instagram and on their website and you had to show a picture of your diamond painting and tell them why you started and why you love it. So I did and you got to win a custom. Now the reason I chose this one I will tell you in just a second when I get it out. So, it comes in a really hard tube, which is good, and it comes with um, a thank you card and a coupon code for your next order. I'll just get it out. Right, talk it. We'll go through it all, shall we, like we're doing a proper unboxing, because well it is. So you get the fantastic four placer, which we all love, and a single placer on a white glittery pen. You get a white tray, a purple squishy that you put on your pen, hang on. Yeah, that's not going on, but you put it on and it's just to grip it. You get some very pointy black tweezers. And what else do you get in here? Three, uh, two plates of wax. One big and one small. Now the size of one was a uh, 40 by 50. And I think this is going to be my next diamond painting I will be doing. Just because, why not? So I will just roll it back. If you've not tried Pretty Neat Creative, oh, I suggest you do. Just because the canvas is so soft. So this is the image. I see a picture on here. Yeah, but you can't see it. So this holds a very special piece in my heart because this is my daughter when she was eight and she moved back in with me. It's a long story, I'm not gonna go through it all, but on the top in the middle you have a diamond, pretty neat creative. Feel the beauty in diamonds. And then you have the size, your canvas number, and a thumbnail, which is that there. You also have two legends, one on either side. And I'll just show you the legend. Actually, no, I won't. I will do that in a minute. On the bottom, you have Pretty Neat Creative and their social media and website. And then you have one of those barcode thingy things. So, you also get a legend. Now this has only got 19 colours. And this legend is very big. So we've got letters and shapes. In my, it could have all just been letters, but hey-ho. And this also has the 
canvas number on it and the size on it and it tells you your 1 to 19 there your symbol code there how many bags you get the weight of the bags the DMC numbers the quantity they give you and the quantity, no, the quantity you need is this bit here and then the quantity they give you and that is some other quantity, don't know what it has <coughs> it's me a lot of drills so let's have a look at the drill fields shall we while we're here Now it is a white background and I probably will change that just to add something different into it because I know it's colour blocking but I don't like colour blocking white. But it looks very clear, very clear indeed. I love how I've got little wisps of a hair. I didn't think we'd keep that on. There's a deep, so there is a lot of colour blocking but there's also, look at that confetti there, don't know what colour blocking is, it's where well, it's all one colour like that and confetti is that, that is confetti but it all looks really good, that there had the, oh you can kind of see it in the camera, it says bench make up a t-shirt but I can don't really need to see it but yeah I could right so dual field is really clear it's a very soft canvas like I said the cover paper is nice and soft very sticky don't normally do that but I will um it isn't scalloped or anything like that but it's fine and the wrinkles you see in the cover are just that they're in the cover you just peel it back smooth it out I'm not good at doing this bit but it just takes the wrinkles out of it so this is going to be my next picture I do I'll turn it over and I'll show you the drills so as I said, we've got 19 colours. So this will probably be a case of just working out of the baggies. Oh, they come so nicely packed and I'm going to ruin them. So we've got three bags of a 3865, which is my least favourite colour, but hey-ho. Then we have grey the mint green that a lot of people like a bit of purple brown and darker mint green a beige now this is our 310 that is what, yeah 310 and 939 love it so that will be the 939 and the bags do come um, like air compacted so we squeeze all the air out and that is a very nice army green then we've got another whitey colour another tan grey grey just the usual greys you'll see in a black and white painting now the reason I've got it black and white is because that's how the picture was taken and um, I actually do like, <coughs> excuse me, black and white and this is the black. They look really good. And then we have got a green with an escapee. So I'm just going to 
pop that back in there. We are going to be static, so I will be putting dryer sheets in. But they are the colours of this painting. And I might even do a whip and chat with it, we'll see. But as I said, I'm not kitting it up. There's no point for 19 colours, is there? So that is a beautiful diamond painting of my beautiful daughter when she was eight. She's now 19. I miss them days. When she was young, she was brilliant. Now she's just a pain in the butt. I'll put it back in there, isn't it? Right, and next one. Now this is something that was gifted to me. She's a friend of mine on Instagram. And she is fantastic. She's called Cindy. I have unboxed it, but I haven't looked at it. Why is there two in here? confused. See, she had this pen that she just bought and it was beautiful and she said she'd send it to me. So it's this green chunky pen with lots and lots of glitter in it and it's got a bit of yellow at the end. Oh, it's just beautiful. I don't know where she got it from. Probably an Abler's outpost because it's in the box. So there's that one. And it's so light, so, so light. I just love the colour, all that glitter. And then the next one, let's have a look at this. Just slacken it. Oh, I'm excited, I don't know what this one is. I'm not being told about this one. <gasps> oh my God. Cindy, what have you done? Isn't it beautiful? It's green and yellow and it's got... That looks like a tree. Oh, that is so, so beautiful. Oh, my God, Cindy. Thank you. You don't watch my YouTubes, but thank you anyway. It's beautiful. They're both beautiful. And that actually feels heavier than the chunky pen. That is so strange. Yeah, these are my two new pens. I'm so excited because it's my second lot of handmade pens. And this one has come with a three place, but I'll be replacing that. And I now have to go buy more metal tips just to put in them. But aren't they beautiful? <gasps> I am in love. Oh my gosh, I've got to try them out straight away. So, that's the end of my video. We've got the painting that I won. And the two pens that Cindy gave me, I will link her Instagram down below so you can check her out. She's amazing. Just give her a follow. She's fantastic. And I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.